Hello everyone. This is Friday, May 24th, the year 2024. It's 12.15 p.m. and our temperature is almost 20 degrees right now. Uh, 18 depending on where you are, it could be 19. Anyways, what a beautiful day in downtown Halifax. It's a picture perfect day. Look at that sky. Not a cloud anywhere to be found in that sky. And all the leaves are out on the trees. Oh, it's beautiful, beautiful sight. I am at the outside gates of Public Gardens, which is right there. Victoria Park is across the street, right there. And I'm just gonna sit here for a few minutes because it's so beautiful just to take it all in. The Lloyd Nelson Hotel is right there on the other side of this intersection. The northeast corner of South Park and Spring Garden. You can tell it's warm out. Look, everybody wearing shorts and t-shirts. I got my jacket on because I I came to the city early this morning and I got stuff in my pockets and there's not super not a super heavy jacket, but it's still warm, but anyways, I have to, to have somewhere to put stuff. I got my bag with me, but it's already got stuff in there that I need. So anyway, that's the way it is. I'll have to tough it out with my uh, denim jacket. It's not that bad. All right. So my first thing I want to say, my first business here, I promised everybody on this channel that I was going to New Brunswick and I was going to make some videos on the way, a road trip, and a video going through St. John and all that kind of stuff. Well, when I went to uh, put it over you know, for, for the computer and all that, it was, it was all in, it's hard to explain, when you go from phone to computer, you get these uh, frames, each each frame that makes up the video, there's a, can divide it all down into frames. And some were going faster than others. If you try to put the two together, it was a mess, but they weren't all going the same speed. So what caused this mess, I don't know. But my phone's been working all right since I got back, but I, I, I pretty much lost my videos I did while I was on our trip. Well, my apologies. I promised everybody I was going to make videos of that. I made a video also on, I think it was Thursday or Friday before I left on my trip. And it was a guy in it. I told him my, my video would be out. It may have been Wednesday or something. I told him my video would be out on Friday. Well, we left on Friday. So I was going to send it, you know, first opportunity. Well... It's gone too. Everything that was on my phone is gone. So I'm starting to go over. So if you, if, you, if you see this week a little dry and you're wondering what happened, where did all my videos? Well, that's the reason. I had a problem with my phone and I'm hoping these are going to work out. I looked at the other ones I've made so far, they look okay. So I think we're going to be all right. It was a glitch. I think I, what I think happened was. I ran my phone a lot on that trip. I think it got too hot. Because if the, you run them too long in the heat, it, 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 they, do, they do get pretty hot. I could feel my screen was hot. So maybe, just maybe, that had something to do with it. I'm not sure. Anyways, this is a new day. Friday, Friday afternoon. Best day of the week for anybody working. Absolutely gorgeous day out here. So, what do you want to do? Do you want to take a walk down through Victoria Park? Okay. I know I've been in, I've been in public gardens quite a bit lately. So maybe I won't go in there today. I've been in there a lot lately. So let's just try going down, down the hill. And maybe I'll walk down Spring Garden. Spring Garden, real, real busy today. We'll do that. 
Let's go through the park first. Let's go down to Victoria Park, which is just across the intersection. And after we go through there, I'll come back up here and we'll go down Spring Garden Road and show you how busy it is today with all these people out here. Look at it. Ah, maybe we'll do that first. Okay, let's do that. Let's walk down Spring Garden Road because there's so many people out here on the street today. Absolutely uh, wonderful day out here today. I think it's the best this year so far. Well, we're only a week away from June, so we got to get into summer right really quick here now. This was, this is the best day I've seen, best I've seen yet this year, right here. On the 24th of May. I'm staying on this side because it's sunny over here. I'm not going to be uh, walking in the shade. I want to walk out here where it's nice and sunny. And beautiful, beautiful sunny day. A good way to go out after a week, work week, I had Friday afternoon. Perfect. It's the best. Best absolute way to go out right here. Starbucks right there. Where well, I go sometimes, but not today. I was reading something about coffee today. Scared me half to death. It said uh, coffee's bad for your brain. I don't know. I think I'd go into uh, a deep, dark depression without my coffee. That's just my opinion. So maybe it's not bad for everybody's brain. But that's what this article said. Of course, I saw it on uh, YouTube, so... Uh, Look at this coming here. <laughs> that was funny. Everybody's out, man. This is like this is like Young Street in Toronto. So many people on the street. In the winter time, there's only the people on here that need to be here, or most of them. Man, this is absolutely wonderful. Let's see if I can get past before we meet too many on the street here and get all clogged up. Man. Oh. I gotta turn my my picture away from this girl because she doesn't like to be videoed, so I'll we'll look at the side. I know you don't like to be on here, so I'm pointing it that way. Oh, well, don't you have a pool, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's so beautiful. I make, a, I make a video today. This is, this is like young street in Toronto. So many people. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You do. That's one of the street people. 
in Halifax. We got a few, we got quite a few really, that are homeless and they wander around on the street. There's some places for them to go. And there's some services that are offered, like the library, you can go in there and sit as long as you want. There's t a TV, TVs to watch, there's magazines to look at. There's a coffee shop in there, and I think there's one hour a day they give free coffee away to people in there. So there's things like that, and there's educational programs going on in there too. I can't go down this side because there's construction. So I gotta go across the road and then it's not down. I'm gonna, there's only another block left to Spring Garden, so I'm gonna go this way and we're gonna, we're gonna get into uh, Victoria Park down here, walk up to it. I promised I'll walk through Victoria Park and that we shall do. Okay. Nice to see these uh, construction jobs that were going on here for so long finally getting to near completion. Might get a little noisy here for a minute. That crane is making that noise. I think they're installing uh, things like refrigeration and uh, you know air, air conditioning and, and heating and that kind of stuff. But they're probably putting it all up on the roof. Well, this will take you down in the south end. But I'm not sure how much storage I got left on my phone. I got to be careful not to run it right out because I got a new one last last week. And I don't know if because I used all my storage, my phone got too hot, or. I'm blaming it on my phone got too hot, but I lost my videos that I worked really hard to make and was going to have them all posted this week and they got lost. Wrecked, totally wrecked, so I couldn't use them. So I got to try to hope that don't happen again. It usually don't because I usually make one video and post it and another one like that. So, But I do have a couple couple on here right now. Well, we'll go one more block and then we'll go over and go up Victoria Park. This is great down here today. Absolutely perfect day. Not a cloud anywhere in the entire sky. Not a cloud. You can't find one. Look, you can't find a cloud. No matter where you look in the sky, you will not see not even one cloud. Look at that, I made a 180, not a cloud to be seen up there. Summer is a great time for making videos. Oh, it's just so good. You don't have to think about the cold weather and cold hands. My feet never get cold because when you're walking, you just get pumps of blood in your toes and you, and you never get cold feet, or I don't. And I only wear sneakers most of the winter. I do have boots for the snowstorms, but other than that, I wear my sneakers. 
and I bought a new pair this year which I'm not gonna wear until I wear them if it rains because the ones that my my other ones that I have on are not very good in the rain they're, they look nice but they're not very rainproof so if it rains I wear the ones I bought for fall but I only had them on once yet so it hasn't rained all that much when I do the video so I only wore them once I want them to be nice and good shape when winter comes so I can walk around in winter and I know I'm not going to fall because of the, the road conditions they have, good, they have good treads on your shoes Oh, yeah, he's got a stop sign there. He almost went right through that stop sign. There's a stop sign there, in case you don't know that. I st okay, we're on uh, Morris, Morris Street. This will take us over to the bottom end of Victoria Park, and we can walk up, through, walk up through the park, but they've still got that wire fence up in there, so we can't enjoy the park completely, but we can walk up between the trees, and what they're trying to do is keep the tents out of the park, but in trying to do that, they ruin the park for everybody else, so I don't know. Maybe we need a tent park. A nice park with all kinds of room for tents. And just have a tent park designated for tents. Maybe that would work. Authentic Chinese food. 950 authentic Chinese food. Mmm. Not a bad price. Oh, it's just so nice out here. It's just absolutely a beautiful day. But I don't see how I'm going to be able to walk around with my damn jacket on much longer. <laughs> well, if I don't walk around it, i got to carry it. And I don't know if there's a, any improvement in that. Indoor it, I guess. Yeah. I had a choice this morning. It was warm when I came out this morning. I could have left my jacket home. Put everything in my backpack, I suppose. I, I could have. Maybe the next day it's nice, I will. I'll leave my jacket on. Put everything in my backpack. Yeah. The only thing I got in my wallet, in my, is my, is my uh, jacket right now is my wallet. And my keys. And I have my phone in there, but right now it's on my gimbal. So. I guess I didn't need my jacket too bad. Historic Smithville, remember the video I made about Canada's fourth prime minister? This is his area where, where, where he's buried. It's kind of down in that direction. I won't go there today because I made a video of it. Kind of thing you only make one of. And everybody can look for it if you want to see it. Absolutely the best day yet this year. I got one more block and I'll be over to Victoria Park. <coughs> Excuse me, I had to sneeze. I could feel it coming. Ah, there. Better now. Now I'm not sick. I haven't got a cold. You know, sometimes something can do. You're walking along and maybe something blows up your nose or something. I don't know. And all of a sudden you get the urge to sneeze.
All right, the park's just over here. But I don't think we're gonna be able to walk in it. Oh, well, maybe there is a path up through there. Maybe. And maybe not. We're about to find out, aren't we? Look, the, the park isn't even managed anymore. The, they haven't cut the grass in here or anything since since they put up those fences. The grass isn't even being cut. Man, what what kind of a place is this? No, I can't take the walkway up through there either. They got the they got the walkway blocked. Can't get through there. Well, I'm gonna go this way anyway to see if there is any way at all to walk up through that park. You're right, that's true. We will never have They got it all closed. You think they at least keep the walkway open? No, they won't even let you use the walkway. Look at it, who'd ever think? This park would come to this. A state like this, who would ever think? I'll put my phone up above the fence. See how awful it is? The grass hasn't been mowed. Nothing done to it. This was one of our prized parks. People like to walk down through. They didn't get rid of the tents. The tents are here, down past the end of the park. The tents are there. The tents are up there. They didn't get rid of the tents at all. They didn't, didn't help. Just move it from one place to another. It doesn't really do much. It'd be much good. No, I think I think it's time that, that all governments in every city get together and find places for people that need need a place to, to live that can't afford it. Like yeah, that's that's what it's come to. Where the rent is so high. Now, unless you got some incomes more than one income in your house, you're going to have to settle for something much less than you wanted. And if it's just you working for minimum wage, you're not going to be getting anything. You won't be getting the rent or anything at all that you can afford if you're on minimum wage working. That's what you get for, for, for working at a minimum wage job. You won't be able to afford a single thing. You won't even probably get a room by the week anywhere because in a month that'll add up to more than you make. We got three of us in our house bringing in an income and I'm retired so I get my check every month. I don't have to worry about that. My wife's still working and our son is working. So there's two paychecks in my, in my retirement that comes in. So anyway, yeah, and it takes a, here I can walk down through here now. Can't really go anywhere when you go in there, but you can walk down to it. Better than nothing, I guess. Yeah, I feel, I feel for the homeless people because I can't really do anything that much to help them, but everybody deserves a place to live. Yeah, I used to take walks up through here. It's so nice in the summer. 
sheltered by all the leaves and everything. See how nice it is walking up through there? And it's all fenced in just because they're trying to keep the tents out. And the tents are down there, in that area down there, and they're still up. So what difference does it make if they're here or there? Yeah. Sometimes the logic, the logic of our uh, politicians, our people in charge, sometimes the logic is not so great. Well, we have a we have a police car there and an ambulance over there. I don't know what might have happened here. We'll keep our eye out for anything. That I can uh, let you know. Oh, I see a crowd gathered over here. Oh no, that's a that's a store. I think that's an ice cream store or something. They're standing in front of. Okay, I don't think we're gonna find out. What, what's going on here? Well, you got this part right here. You can sit in this part. That's all you got. You got one little end here, so you can go in. I want to see how much time is on this. 27 minutes. I might end it around here because you got to be careful not to put too much on this phone. They got already got a couple on there. So I want to have enough room to sign off. And so here I am, right where we started this video. Spring Garden Road in Cell Park. This is where we began, on the other side of the street. And this is where we're ending, after a nice walk around downtown. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget that like button. And if you're not yet a subscriber, I'd love it if you were set subscribe. There is a notification bell, you'll get a little ding every time I post a video. Now I gotta catch up for the week we lost last week. So anyways, with that, I hope you're having a really good day. Take care, be safe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now.